on a horse just over three months ago. He's had uh, tuition off the likes of Leighton Aspel. And good luck to him here riding Rich Tea Biscuit. Black colours with the stars on the sleeves. He thinks he's going to finish last. Let's hope he doesn't. They are making their way towards the start here. Not long now before we are ready for action. Judges microphone test, one, two, three. Runners are at the start now. James Dunn with plenty of support down there. Rich T. Biscay looks calm and collected, James. Good luck to him here. Of course, the other boys have done this on thoroughbreds many times. Not sure about that experience on the Shire horses, but it's something all jump off OK, because they've all got a handler. And they are at the start. They're lining up here, and they're off. They're racing for the Shower King Flying Feathers Shire Horse Grand National. Good start, older Nicky and Tommy Carberry. Leading up to Red Vodka and Tom Bellamy. I'm afraid James Dunn's at the back of the field on Rich Tea Biscuit. It's Red Vodka in front to older Nicky in second. Then Desert Cactus, Luke Morris Sparkle going far side, but it's Red Vodka inside the final furlong who leads Red Vodka and Tom Bellamy. Oh, Luke Morris has been unseated from Sparkle. Luke Morris is on the floor. Here on the near side comes older Nicky, the 10-year-old. Older Nicky and Tommy Carberry will win. Older Nicky's first. Red Vodka's second. Frankly was third. Fourth Desert Cactus. Then came Sugar. And a big gap to Ned Junk. He's going to cross the line. And James Dunn riding Rich Tea Biscuit. He hadn't sat on a horse three months ago. He's finished last, but he's completed the course. Unlike poor old Luke Morris, who got unshipped from Sparkle. Looking back, Luke is up. And Sparkle continuing riderless. He's going out for another circuit by the looks of things. First, number two, Older Nicky. Second, number four. Third, number seven. And the fourth place horse, number five. The full result of the 2016 Shower King Flying Feathers Shy Horse Grand and National. First, number two, Older Nicky. Second, number four, Red Vodka. Third, number seven, Frankly. And fourth, number five, Desert Cactus. Lunt all took part there. Older Nicky winning. Sponsored by Shower King, the race sponsors. Tommy Carberry producing Older Nicky with a late run to get up. We're watching the head on again. Let's just uh, see what happened here. I hope Luke Morris is OK. He looks a bit dazed when he got to his feet. You see James Dunn riding Rich Tea Biscuit at the back on the right. Up front. I thought Red Vodka was going to win the race. Maybe Tom Bellamy went a bit too soon on Red Vodka. Was out in front, the light blue sleeves. Yeah, he's lost his irons, Luke Morris. He looked very uncomfortable and he quickly got dislodged from Sparkle. The shy horse is absolutely fine, Sparkle. Luke Morris got to his feet. A little bit dazed, but oh dear, I hope he's all right. Um, we'll get a check on Luke Morris. But it's certainly just a nasty fall. He kind of lost his irons. His feet got out of the stirrups and he had to just get off the horse as quickly as possible. And the horse is absolutely fine. But meanwhile, older Nicky won it. The 10-year-old older Nicky was the winner. Well done to Tommy Carberry. Good run by Red Vodka in second for Tom Bellamy. Third home was Frankly. 